Hey everybody. So I just did this one. That is not what it looked like at the end of the video, but that is what I did to it. I added to it. I tilted some more. I'm in love with it. And so, because you know, I can't leave well enough alone. So once again, I'm going to try and recreate sort of a, not an accent, but I, I'm not exactly sure how I can replicate that, but I'm going to attempt to on this 10 by 20 canvas. So, I am just going to start painting. Um, if you want to know details about how I mix my paint and da 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 da, -da um, you can search. Use the search function on the front page. Um, for those of you who just watched that blue pour, my wrist is um, starting to get black and blue already. <laughs> so, and I smashed my finger, but that was after the painting was finished. So, I am going to, goodness gracious. This is a toughie, I'm trying to figure out. Well, I want some areas totally white. Oops, that's not totally white. I'm just gonna kind of make some areas white. Um, let's just tilt this around, see where it goes. I actually don't have a lot of white paint left, so hopefully I have enough for this. Let's pour some down here. All right, so my first tip. Flip cup will be, let's see. Build um, with white. Oh, I really, really, really hope I have enough white. Yes, this is the look I wanted. I needed a base. I wanted these colors in here, but I wanted them light and more as a base. So they're, they're just kind of background colors. And one of them has the silicone in it too. So I want that silicone on. And I so much dripped off paint on here from the pour I just did that I should have enough paint. hoping this works.
have to wet the back and put some of those tighteners on. This one does not feel very, this one looks like it's dipping. It's a brand new one too. I wonder if I had something sitting on it or what the deal is. Okay. I'm gonna do lime green, a little bit of white, Hello blue. So basically, it's more of a swipe. Let's see where I'm at. I just, I basically just love this color combination of the lime and that phthalo blue. Hopefully when I wet the back that it will dry tighter. Um, and I do have some of those, um, you know, the wood thingies, I blanking, that you put in the corners behind it to tighten it up. I've never had this happen though. It's very odd. This is exactly the look I wanted. Yes, 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 it worked. Because see, I needed that first, the under base, under base, the base underneath, and those other colors, and then these bright ones on top. That's exactly how I wanted it. Yay, these things hardly ever happen exactly. So I am just going to touch up. Um, that I don't like. Oh, darn it. Darn it, darn it. I don't even have anything clean. To really appreciate the lazy Susan I made, which I am not using right now. I just love this. I torch it a little. Very, very cool. I'm just getting rid of the cells I don't like that bother me. I thought I 
can make cool waistbands. Oh, goodness. Oh, there's a lot of pink on there. Ooh, how did I not see all that? Well, that wouldn't have helped the sagging. How could I have missed, like, a bucket of paint on there? Actually, I like it as I'm tilting this part out more. It's kind of cool. so long. They look good. Hopefully that got rid of enough paint. Very cool. I like it. I like it. Let me just double check. God, there's still a ton. When it moves that easy, it's there's too much. To be able to leave. It shouldn't just flow like that. I knew this was too easy to be true. So I'm just kind of letting it drip. Alrighty. Now I think it's not moving anymore. So let's get that looks like an eye. I like it. Mysterious.
Doesn't that look like an eye down there? That's neat. Thank you so much for watching. And please subscribe and I will catch you next time. Bye. Hey everybody. Hi, I'm back. Um, I don't even know why I bother turning off the camera because I still mess with this. So look how awesome. I got rid of the stuff that was right over here. It was just kind of some bluish nothingness, really. I replaced it with white. So it has a much crisper look. And now it's got that eye up there in the corner. And then nothing. And then all this. So it has very distinctive um, areas. And... I really love it now. Like I liked it at the end, but obviously not totally because I kept working on it. Um, so I like it even more now. I am very proud of that one. And I'll show you a closer up of this is the one that I totally changed up once I turned the camera off. Um, so I like it a lot better. That's a weird little shape. So I just wanted to update you on those. Um, I definitely on that one made a really good choice, a uh, decision on changing it. So there you go. And um, I think I'm done. I'm totally done. I'm not changing either of these. I may just mix up some new paints. Have a good day. Bye.